Hi everyone, welcome to another Creative Suite online tutorial. In this lesson I'll be going through the ins and outs of motion tweening. So what is motion tweening? Well motion tweening is the placement or transition of an object from one place in the timeline to another. So basically it's a movement of an object. I'll show you guys an example of this. I'll go over, I'll go over to the oval tool I'll create a circle and I'll convert this circle into a symbol. I'll type ball for the name, have the type as movie clip and set the registration to the center. I'll click OK and in order for you to have a object uh, motion tweened you have to convert that object into a symbol. Each object has to be converted into a symbol in order for you to motion tween it. Okay, now once that's done, I'll click on the 51st frame of my first layer. I'll insert keyframe there. And I should probably tell you now that if you wanted your object to motion tween for 50 frames, you would place the keyframe on the 51st frame. And the reason for that is is that the last frame acts as a buffer or a stop key that stops producing the motion tween. So if you had any sort of animation on this last frame, it basically wouldn't show. So let's go ahead and create a motion tween. Click anywhere between the uh, second frame and the 50th frame. So I'll right click, go to create motion tween like so and you should see that the bar has filled into a light bluish color. I will then click on the 50th frame and I'll drag the red ball over to the right hand of the screen. Once you've done that you should see a green dotted line that was produced. Basically this tells us where this image originated from so where it's going to come from okay so let's hold down control and enter and if we hold down control enter we'll see that our new flash movie will see the effects of motion tweening so basically the ball is moving to the left is moving to the right from the left like so I'll exit that and what I'll do now is I'll right click on the 51st frame I'll remove this frame I'll click on the 70th frame right click insert keyframe and I'll insert it at the position I'll then click on the 70th keyframe and I'll drag the ball upwards like so I'll then hit control and enter again and as you can see the ball moves. That's basically the basics of motion tweening of what motion tweening is. Um, I hope this tutorial helped you guys. If you have any questions please uh, put them in the comments section and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching guys.